the lessons are in the journey and I'm not seeing the lessons. I'm not getting the lessons that I need. I'm not realizing and understanding the lessons yet in the journey. So that's why it's not coming. And I say that because so many times when I've wanted the X goal to happen, whatever that thing is that I wanted to happen, I wanted it to come. I wanted it fast. In retrospect, I wasn't, I wouldn't have been able to handle it. If I would have gotten it when I wanted it to happen, I would have screwed the whole thing up. The journey needed to be a little bit longer. The journey needed to be harder. The journey needed to be a little bit more painful. I, need to, I needed to have a little bit more suffering for me to find the lessons, understand the lessons, see the jewels in all of it. So I say all of that for you guys to embrace your journey. I know you guys have, and I want you guys to have the big, huge goal that you want to hit and I want you guys to hit and you will hit it but along the way the journey the experiences within the journey are where it's really at where the rewards are really at because once you hit that if I was just to get to the goal and share it with you guys it's like oh I just went into a straight line boom 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 no problems and I got to it how would I share what, what, what do I have to share with you guys how can I connect with anybody because in reality it's nothing's ever linear the reality is we're going to go up, we're going to go down. We might be going to take a back step, move step forward. I'm able to connect. I'm able to share all these different things because the journey for me has been crazy. <laughs> the journey for me has been rough. <laughs> but then I thought to myself, I really had to ask myself, all right, if you could have made it easier, if you could have had it easier right, right now, everything you went through would you have wanted it to be easier and i was like okay let me let me let me really really think about that and the answer is no i wouldn't have wanted it any easier it's crazy for me to say i'm grateful for how difficult it was which is like it's not it's almost like weird to say that right but it's given me so many lessons within the journey, not getting the reward. I've gotten so many lessons and thankful for the lessons that no book could have ever told me, right? I couldn't have read it on a brochure. None of that would have been able to truly show me, teach me, guide me in certain ways than the experiences, than the lessons within that. And within the experiences, connecting with individuals as well. Being able to even connect with some of you guys on here who have had similar experiences or getting ready to be on your journey. When I was on some, some journeys that I've been on. So I want you guys to know, that's why we like, like a hero story, for example. Why do we like the hero? And sometimes why do we even like the villain? because of that journey for them to get to that. Why do we like Batman? I'm, I like Batman more than Tony Stark and Iron Man because Batman became Batman through what? Tragedy. He went through what he had to with his parents and that pain and that suffering that he deals with every day transformed him into the Dark Knight. Tony Stark's, he just got a bunch of money and felt he wanted to do right. <laughs> Nah, okay, cool, I, thank you, but I'm gonna connect with a hero story that is drenched in tragedy. And to see somebody overcome that, and see you guys overcome that, I'm connected with that. When I read some of you guys, when you guys hit me up, shoot me a message, and I see how you guys are overcoming, I connect with that. So as you guys are going through that journey of yours, embrace it a little bit more learn from it because when you do reach to that goal you're going to be like okay all right cool we, we got it you're going to be like all right on to, on to the next but as the experiences leading up to it they will stay and resonate far more than actually get it getting it like i'll even use jujitsu for example when i got my black belt of course extremely grateful happy 
all of that stuff. But once it was tied around my waist, I was just like, oh, okay, well, I'll, all right, back to training. But it's all the years <laughs> leading up to it. The injuries, the this, the setbacks, the broken fingers, the, all of that. That's what I share. That's what it's about. That's what it's really about. The black belt is just to let maybe others know, hey, what time I'm on. But for me, it's all the, it's the culmination of all the time, energy, sacrifice leading up to it. Sometimes I wish I would have just embraced it just a little bit more. So your journey, it's gonna be painful. It's gonna be this, you're gonna have some setbacks. You're going to have, you know, some, some doubt at times, but that is when you can take those things and make that your biggest teaching. Sometimes we need to just put that mirror in front of ourselves and say, okay, what do I need to work on? And those things that we need to work on a lot of times are within that quest and that mission on your way to getting to the bigger goal. But it's up to you guys to see that. Okay? So, I'll make this one quick. We got more on the way, but I just want you guys to think about that. The journey. Let's go.